Hi, hello guys, welcome to this channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to do in Microsoft. I uh, sorry, in Google Sheet. Uh, actually, it's similar to Microsoft Excel, but I haven't to try how to find the closest value to X. For example, I here already have the data sets. I made it simple, a random number. Now, how to find the closest to X, which means the X is five. Okay, how to doing that? Just follow my step. Actually, it's very easy, but uh, needs several steps to follow. I mean, maybe seven or eight steps to follow. Okay, how to doing that? First, I want to uh, revisual the data by sorting them to make it easier to us to make to see which which value is closest to five. Oops. Now the data is already sorted, so we can check manually the closest is 4.98 or 5.06. Actually, the closest is 4.98. Now, how to doing that? We do uh, this column only for visual, so uh, just to check manually, and then this one we, I will do uh, the formula by step by step. Now we can check array formula and then we drag this one and then uh, to deduct to 5. Okay, but put the absolute value, absolute, uh, absolute function. Now we have all the new value which is uh closest to zero in absolute so we can find this value is the closest to zero which means actually same closest to five so after that you can find by index or by small find small click the data and then click the n is one which means is the closest or the lowest value so the closest to zero one will return this value. So to make it you easier, I will make it just three of comma. Okay. Now we can find this one, and then we just add the same value with closest one. Now we already have which data is closest to zero, but we, when we check this one. We couldn't find because what? Because the value should could be plus C5, uh, C1 or minus C1. Because we remember that uh, previously I do absolute uh, function. Now how to doing that? We can do if conditional. Just simple if if we look up this value to the data set index one and then shorted we going back to the vlookup is error function is error means the function is should be plus so coba, uh, comma and then d4 plus 10 why plus 10 because previously in this d cell i deduct to five uh, minus fi uh, five so if i want to plus five which mean plus 10 and then comma d4 see i already find uh, the closest uh, i mean here should be plus and then here should be minus 10 see this one the wrong result because should be not plus but minus 5 here the good answer the correct answer now we have to, we have to compound all this function into one cell it's very uh, must be it should be carefully do you have to carefully do it so the d4 cell i will enter to the e4 cell by copying the formula not the equal and then rep 
replace the D4 mentioned here by the formula I copied before hit enter now I know I don't need the D4 anymore so I delete it and then I want to compound this data set to this function so I just copy this function array formula blah 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 and then just replace the cell that mentioned the C4 to C14 hit the enter now I no need anymore this data set so I move it to the left let's see closest to X is 4 is 4 uh, 4 9 8 5 better I put absolute now what if I modify the 4 this one to 7 which mean the closest value should be 5.6 5.06 so it returned the 5.06 it's correct okay this application is very useful if you have a lot of data sets you want to find the closest to some things sometimes we want to the effective ways like uh, turn off inventory turnover is uh, the effective is 100% so we, we could find 100.6 100.1 99. something and so on and so on so we have to find the closest to 100% this method you can follow Okay, I hope it's useful for you. If you have any question, please put on the comment below. If you like, please subscribe our channel. Thank you. Bye.